Streamlabs desktop is continuing to develop features to improve the lives of streamers and gamers, content creators like you and myself to take advantage of. One of those amazing features is Streamlabs collab cam, which is awesome for being able to add multiple different angles and perspectives of different people that you're playing with live on stream. So how do you set something like this up? Well, all you need to do is go to one of your scenes. I'm gonna be in my gameplay window, have your gameplay or capture card source already within your scene, and then make sure you also have your face cam in there as well. And then after that, just go ahead and select the plus button next to sources. And then you'll see an option for collab camera under general sources. Select that, add the source, you can name it whatever you like. I'm gonna add in a mystery name so I know who this scene is for. Then I'm gonna select add source. And then you're gonna see an invitation URL listed for you. This is the link that you're gonna to wanna to copy to send out to different people that you want to join your stream. If you have Streamlabs Prime, you can add up to four guests at a time. Below that, you'll see your webcam and microphone sources that can be selected for your guests to be able to see and hear you a part of this collab cam party. The share video source option will allow you to share one of your video capture sources, which we'll see in action in just a second. All right, I'm gonna share my link to my homie and we'll wait for him to join so we can game. It's Creighton TV here. After clicking Midnight Man's collab cam link, all I needed to do was add my name, select my microphone and camera, then click join and boom, I was in. When your guest joins your collab cam session, you'll get a Streamlabs notification which you can click on on the left hand side. Or you can double click the collab cam source to see who's just joined your party. Each participant within your collab cam session is going to have their own tab, which if you're in that tab, you can select to show their face camera on your stream. If you have additional participants in your party that you want to make sure are shown on stream, click on their tab and assign them to an existing source or a new source that collab cam will generate. With your friend's face cam sources added as overlays within your scene, go ahead and adjust the position and resize them as you see fit. And feel free to get creative with it. Add face cam borders, throw the face cams on other scenes and layouts, just have fun with it. But what's great is just how easy it is to record and hear all of your party chat audio without issue. Meaning now you can mute the chat audio sources within your game or your console because you're gonna be listening to your chat audio from Streamlabs. On Creighton's side, he was able to hear me and even see my video capture source I was sharing out from that feature I was showing you guys earlier in the video. And he was seeing this all within the browser of his mobile device. How about using this camera as a second angle, like with with the mobile phone. Sure, you could do that, but it won't be in sync with your primary face cam. I'd say the best second angle shot using collab cam would be using your mobile device to get a point of view shot of either your controller, your keyboard setup when you're gaming, or you can even use collab cam as a way to stay engaged with your stream if you have to leave your primary setup while you're live. The experience gaming in a collab cam party using Streamlabs desktop was pretty smooth overall. I did notice that using this feature, it will require more resources out of your computer. So you'll need to have a pretty good machine to run your streams or recording smoothly while in a collab cam session. This is such a good replacement for Discord because now you can just add your friend's web cameras to the mix of your stream, making it that much better. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure you hit it with a big thumbs up, subscribe to the channel if you're new around here. Make sure to subscribe to Creighton TV as well. Big shout out to him for helping me with this video. And also a big shout out to Streamlabs to showcase this new feature to you guys. Let me know what your experience is like using this in the comment section below. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.